Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial in Sony Vegas. This is Eat Sleep here from the Techies, and I'm going to show you how to make kind of advanced, uh, very nice looking credits in Sony Vegas. So first of all, how I'm going to do this is this is going to be set up by having two video clips playing on the left side and credits rolling on the right side. So. I don't have two clips, so I'm just going to quickly make make these two here. So, yeah, I'm just making uh, quickly two video clips because I don't have two right now. Okay, so there we go. We have our two video clips, and they are overlaying on top of each other. So first what I want to do is I want to make this first video go into the top left part of the screen here. Uh, this can be done in the Track Motion uh, Properties menu. So when we pull it up, uh, over here on the left, it gives us the Position tab and that's mainly what we're going to be looking at today and if you can't see that just drag it out so I, since I want this uh, video to be half half the screen cov two videos covering half the screen so this needs to be a fourth as big as the entire screen so I'm gonna cut this video in half and make it 360 and as you can see here, it already cut it into a smaller chunk or a fourth of the screen. And if you go ahead and type 360 in and hit enter, it should give you the automatic height adjust if you have this button lock aspect ratio on, which allows you to just keep the ratio of height to width. So now we're going to move this over to the top top left region portion of the video space and essentially the center point of this video is now at 180 so if I want to snap it to the left side of the screen I have to move it back negative 180 and as you can see it snaps to the left side of the screen and with the Y it's kind of like the same thing except I just want to move it up so I'll just go 120 up and we have our first top left portion done essentially I'm going to do the same thing in the second video 360 negative 180 but this time for the Y position we want to move down 120 because we want it to go down so now we have our two videos that are laying on top of each other on the left side of the screen. So, anyways, is a quick tip here. You can highlight your video and hold Shift B, and it'll go ahead and kind of like pre-render it. So, if you're playing your preview on full or quarter or whatever, uh, it should lag less, or hopefully, it should lag. It shouldn't lag at all. And this will take a quick minute here. It's almost done. Just. I'm going to go ahead and fast forward to when this is done. We are back, and our little clip has finished pre rendering. So when I go play it back, as you'll notice, it's kind of like completely lag free, which is good. I like that. So now we're going to add a credit uh, generator which is under the media generators tab under credit roll now we have a lot of options we can choose here different kind of effects that happen but I'm just gonna choose plain scrolling on black now when you drag this in you'll have all these options here and the first thing I'm gonna point out is since we want our credits on the black side of the video then we have to drag the position of it over. 
like so. And I'm going to go ahead and drag this down. So if we go ahead and look, we have our credits playing on the right side of the video. But, if you notice right there, some of the words are getting cut off. So now another way you can fix that is either make this longer, and if you go under the Styles tab, you can go under here and change all kinds of stuff. You can change the font size, you can change the color of the font, Good color of the font there, you can change the background color, I'm actually going to move it to transparent, just just because. And when we go back to the properties tab, uh, if you want to insert new uh, uh, little uh, sections you want to put in your credits, you can just click right under your last item and go to, you want a paragraph one or you want a two column or a new header. or I'm not actually sure what's the limit on it because um, I haven't really made too many credits made like two. You can also choose uh, the effect. You can do a time sequence which is a little more difficult to do but it does look kinda nice. So you can also do uh, the scroll direction. It's either up or down which I don't know why you would really have... well actually both of them look pretty good. So uh, please experiment with that. Uh, ask if you have any questions this has been Eat Sleep from the Techies. Thanks for watching.